We're going on to now our third panel. So we spoke earlier this morning about the foundations for getting started in this new practice. Now let's talk about growing in that practice and, and succeeding in that practice. I thought we'd start by just talking for a few minutes about the whole issue about success and work-life balance and succeeding at home, at work, and at everywhere else. All right? Trying to stay away from cliches and offer more actionable steps on how you can be at peace with yourself, with the people okay. you work with, with your family, and other people with whom you relate. And I only really have only one word to share with you. And I learned this at a Friday morning grand round more than 30 years ago, back in San Antonio, Texas. And a visiting professor came and spoke about success at work, at home, in the neighborhood, and, and with your children. And he spoke to the one thing that causes separation and distance to occur. The one thing that leads to hard feelings, that makes it hard for you to go to work during the day, or perhaps hard for you to come home at the end of the day. And that one thing has to deal with expectations, specifically unmet expectations. You said you would be honest. You said you'd be true to me. You said you would take care of the money. You said that I would see 2020 after this surgery. You said you would take call for me. This is all about one party having shared expectations with another party. And if you don't meet those agreed expectations, there will be trouble. And if anybody begins to want to achieve work-life balance, they have to remember what is expected of me and what am I expecting of others? Because if there are unmet expectations, then nothing else is going to happen. So as you follow along in your careers, and you may think back now in some experiences during your residency, all right, or during fellowship, when did you feel the worst? The root of it is going to go back to somewhere there was an unmet expectation. Somebody else didn't deliver for you, or oh my gosh, you failed to deliver for somebody else. If you can do that and remain aware of these expectations and refresh them in your own mind and with the people you work with, then, then you will have satisfaction every day of your life. So that's my homily. We should take up a collection right now.